Hey, what's up, my guys? We're back here with um, he, there she he is. I still don't know how to say the name, but today I'm uh, starting the next video. Of this the first video was kind of messed up. The audio was kind of screwy. Um, I tried to edit as hard as I could, but for some reason I couldn't edit the, the uh, background uh, sound to go down lower. But uh, but y'all can still read the screen. Y'all can still understand what I'm trying to say. You can read it and blah blah. If it goes too fast, it goes. I'm sorry. You can, uh, so, but I got back with this back with this view. <clears throat> uh, okay, let's just start. The next morning, I'm at the train station in the village. I wasn't even sure that it was the station as it was so old looking and so small. I didn't know there were such small train stations in the country. Tachikun! It's like our train ride. She was wearing a little blue summer dress and the strip and a striped shirt and crap uh, and cute lace shoes that doesn't hide much of her little feet. I usually find I uh, usually find the school uniform sexy, but I had to admit that the casual outfit was that she was wearing suits her such much. It, so much, so much, it looks sexier. Uh, sorry, guys, I'm trying to text my friend real quick. Oh, crap. Uh, come on, night time. Okay. Okay, back to this. Good morning, Tachi. Sorry for the wait. Good morning, Sakura chan. Ready to, ready to visit the city? It's not as big as Tokyo for sure, but really bigger than the village. I'm sure for the. Sh I'm ready for the tourists, didn't I? I get it. I do a bit, but I was embarrassed. If I go there to buy the yukata, she would notice it. But if I don't, Rika will make fun of me at the festival. What should I do? Tell the truth to Sakura, keep the secret and buy another day. Uh, okay, tell the truth. Sakura chan, yes. I lied yesterday, I don't have any yukka at that. In fact, I was planning to buy one in the city while visiting it with you. Is that so? <laughs> it's okay, I'll help you find one. Really? Gee, thanks. I said I had one. I said I had one to avoid any of Rika's nagging. Uh, hang on a second, guys. I gotta, I gotta uh, do something quick. Uh, sorry, I text my friend to tell him uh, where to go to to look at stuff about anything. So yeah, I'm sorry. Hang on, me a drink. Okay. I understand. I think I'd do the same thing if I was you. <laughs> Arika is very unique. I saw her relief and left was in left was second chan. I think she saved me yet again. <clears throat> Our train arrived and we boarded it towards the city. Uh it was three stations ahead, almost 30 minutes of travel. Uh, I'm so bored. I love making videos for y'all though. We finally arrived at the city. It was big, just as Sakura chan said. Here we are. The shopping area is not far, only two streets away. Good, shall we go, Senpai? Sakura, Sakura smiled and we started walking in the streets. After some time, we finally reached a street full of different shops. Coloring, multimedia, restaurants, arcades. There was everything here. I was excited. I had no sh I have not shopped since I moved from Tokyo. But I must find a Yukata, yukata first. At first. I guess, I admit. So we started with the clothes shops. <clears throat> ah. 
Ugh. There's absolutely no you got the under the price of 200,000 yens. It's definitely too expensive for a budget I had. So I could have seemed to think about something while I was sh checking the price. So sorry that I couldn't afford it. You got that for myself. Nah, forget it. After all, it's not like I, that I needed one. And maybe you, you could try and forgot about it already. I hope. We should just continue our tour. Hmm, okay. So want to do something next? Sure, how about the arcade? I'm curious to see how good you are at shooting. Dee hee. <clears throat> Dee Alright, let's go. Oh, damn. We played a game of Silent Mountain together. <clears throat> damn it. You know what game that looks like? It's an arcade game, a place I go to. Well, my, well, I went with my girlfriend, my friend. It's called uh, Time Crisis 4, I think it was called. That's exactly how it looks. <clears throat> That's just weird. Okay. We played a game of Sun Hill together. She was definitely good at it. She knew exactly where the zombies were, were about to, to appear and shot them before they could even get to the act. I used up all my credits while she didn't lose any life at all. Wow, Sakura Sun, you definitely are better than I am. You know the game by heart or something? She was concentrating on the game. Nah, not really. In fact, it's the only the third time I played this game. This one. I think it's my reflexes that makes me good at this game. She was cute shooting with that fake gun as if it was real, but her tongue sticked out in concentration. I think my feelings of attraction for her started to change into love. But I'm not sure. And I still can't guess what she thinks of me. <clears throat> uh, da, 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 da. After, that, after that, we ate some yukakitori. Uh, yeah, after that, we ate some yukakitori at a food, fast food restaurant. Then we returned to the village by train. We had a fine morning and noon. Sakura seemed to think about something throughout our date. And she was still in deep thought when we were near her house. Tachikun? Yeah? I have an idea. Just wait here a minute. She runs into the to her house and comes back, at, back with something blue. It looks like a, some, a set of clothes. Here, take it. It's a bit small, but you can make it bigger with some touch-ups. I, I unwrapped the blue thing. I can't believe it. It's a yukata. I chuckled. I chuckled. Oh, I can't talk. I chuckled. I thought it was one of her own yukatas. I was imagining how it would look like. Uh, how I would look like in a yukata for a girl. But after a closer look, I noticed that it was really a cute kind of for a male. Wow, for real? I can borrow. I can borrow this. You can keep it, Tachi Kun. It's okay. Gee, why? Thank you. Thank you for so much. Well, I gotta go. See you in school, Sakura Chan. Have a nice weekend, Tachi Kun. So going back and back to her house. She really has a habit of saving my life. But this is strange. How did she get that? You got the. It looks like it's size for her. Oh, maybe it was a you got that from her father when he was young. But it looks so new. It looks like it was never used. They couldn't buy the buy that one by mistake, or could they? <clears throat> oh well, let's go home now. Okay, another week has passed. School was great with with Rika Chan and Sakura Chan around. <laughs> oh, God. During those two weeks, I really started to feel that I'm part of the village already. Now, ow. I popped my fingers, it hurt. Happy, but I don't know yet if I was I have feelings for Sakura yet or not. 
Well, at least I won't ha have any for you, Rikichan. No way, duh. Tachikun! Sakashan, how it goes? Sakai buzz at me, her face seems flushed. Tachi, are you doing anything this weekend? Nothing at all. Except seeing you at out except seeing you out on a date. She Sakura giggles. <laughs> Damn it. That was the thing I was about to ask you. Of course I'd always like to go out with you to see. Great. I'll wait for you at the train station at 9 a.m. Alright. Ah, time for classes. The day passed quickly as usual. And then the date with Sakura arrives the next morning. This time we started started the date with an American fast food because we are really already hungry. After this we tried karaoke. Uh after this we tried karaoke. Sakura voice was incredibly beautiful. You could be a very popular pop popular pop pop idol, Sakura Chan. <laughs> Thank you. But I don't want to be that. Be one though. Eh, why is that? Well, damn it. She has there a long time before replying. I don't think I'd like the the lifestyle of a popular idol. It's so much work and you don't have a lot of time for yourself when you do this. Yeah, I understand. By the way, what would you like to do in the future? I don't know r really yet. <coughs> uh. Uh, hang on, I gotta try and text real quick. Uh, there you go. Okay. If y'all watch any other YouTubers, um, I don't think they have this many distractions, I think. Or, well, some of them, I don't know. Maybe part of the symph symphony orchestra, if I can. You play an instrument? Yes, the violin. I suddenly remembered. So the violin that I heard here sometimes in the evening, it was her? So you're the one playing the violin during the evening. She looked down embarrassed. Oh, you heard me playing? Yes, you played so perfectly. You, you amazed me. Why, th thank you. Okay. I hope I can watch you play someday. I'd be happy to play for you, Tachi-kun. After some some more songs, we where I was horribly awful at singing. That at least made Sakura Chan laugh. <laughs> we were about to go back to the city station. Suddenly, as we were cro about to cross the road, a car drove near us so fast, crossing the red light. Sakura stepped back too quickly, and I fell on her back, and fell on her back. I caught her just in time and she fell in my arms. Oh my god, it looks like he's, she's like, he's already like taking her. Like, take it, it looks like, she, oh my god. Okay, y'all gonna help you hate me for saying this? It looks like he's already taking her virginity. Is what it looks like. I'm just saying, like, it looks like, it's like she's like, I'm ready. Come take me, take me, take me. <laughs> that's what it looks like. Okay. She looks like me with her big, beautiful blue eyes. Time stopped. As we were looking at each other, we were almost we almost forgot about the car incident. Tachi, gun. Sakura-chan. She closed her eyes facing me. Her little mouth not completely closed. Her just seemed to be waiting for me. Oh my God! I think she wants me to kiss her. I can't believe it. My heart was beating loudly, so loud I was pretty sure the people around us could hear it too. I approached. I pushed my face to hers slowly, slow, very slowly. I could almost feel her breath on my face. At the second my nose touched her, no her own, she turned her face away, embarrassed, and stood up. I'm, I'm okay. Mm. Let's go home. I was in daze as we were on the way back home. I was pretty sure she wanted me to kiss her, but in the end, I was refused. Hey, you got rejected. Oh, does it? Oh, it doesn't matter. Maybe it's just because it's her first time and that she is so shy that she doesn't feel ready for this. 
Uh, hang on, guys. Got something that's text. Oh my god, my friends are texting me like crazy on kick. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Uh. Uh. Damn, hate texting and trying to make it be at the same damn time. Maybe it's just because she isn't the first time, blah, 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 and, and, and that she is so shy that she doesn't feel ready for this. I feel happy inside me, though, because it means that she's attracted to me. But I also feel confused just as much. This girl was totally quiet the way, all, along the way. Uh, I was embarrassed. The atmosphere was uncomfortable since the car incident. Uh, suddenly she breaks the silence. Tachikun? Yes. Okay, now it is starting to get creepy. I... I have something to tell you. What is it? As we converse, she enters the rice field. Why would you follow a chick into the rice field? Like really, why would you follow her into any kind of field? Rice field, corn field, any field. Why would you follow a chick? I know, I mean like, even though she's beautiful and bullshit, yeah. But still, why would you follow her? Oh my god, can't you see from her face? She's fucking scary as shit. And right now she's scary as hell. The road was small and surrounded by big rice plants. It was an empty road, nobody around us. Only the chance, the chance of the sick, sick horizon could be here heard. It's something hard to tell you. Very difficult. It's difficult for me to say it to you, as it is difficult for you to understand it. That sounds serious. I feel my heart beating. I never saw Sakura chan so determined before. I'm about to tell you this because I trust you. I smiled. And you can, Sakura chan. You're my best friend. And you're. And you. You and Rika Chan are are my best friends. I'll never betray you, any of you. Need never. I sincerely do from from the front of my from the front of my heart. You promise never, forever and ever. I smiled again. She followed, smiled family, but kept her serious face immediately after. It's so hard to tell you. Actually, besides my parents, only Rika Chan knows about it. All the other ones. She, the other ones who seems to to know have just heard rumors about it, or aren't aren't sure. Okay, is she about to tell me she's a freaking dude or something, or she got AIDS or something, or she want to tell me she got crabs or something? I don't know. She wants to say, I don't know. She wants to say something, but I'm about, I'm about to get freaking freaked out unless I get through. Uh, I was confused. What is she trying to say? Obviously, she and Rika Chan knew a secret, and Sakura Chan was about to tell me this secret. I feel feel, feel happy that. That means she accepted me as a as a as a best friend as well as Rika Chan, and that she really trusted me. What the, what the hell? Okay. She stopped after walking three meters from me, facing away. She was in front of the sun, so I couldn't could only see her shadow. Tachi kun, do you remember the day when those thugs bullied me? Yes, I remember. Do you know what they said to me? Yes, clearly. They were trying to make you admit that you were a boy or something like that. Yes. It's because they... They guessed it. As soon as they knew it. I... What are you trying to say? tachi -kun. I really am a boy. Oh my... <laughs> are you serious? Oh my god. I don't know what to think. Who can't? I can't believe it. No, she can't be a boy. It's impossible. You, you are a boy? I started to laugh to myself nervously. I couldn't believe it. It's surely a joke, right? No, you can't be a boy, Sakura-chan. sakura didn't say anything. She suddenly turned around and, and approached me. If you don't believe me, take a look at this. She said, <laughs> Are you serious? Screwed up, showing her panties. I screamed out of screamed out of embarrassment. I looked around, but fortunately there was still nobody. I already tried not to look at it and covered my eyes. No, Sakura-chan, I can't look. It's too embarrassing. Please do. 
Damn. Her cute blue eyes were glaring at me. She was really serious. So I slowly looked down to her waistline. She was wearing some cute blue girl panties. But in the panties there was something. Something that shouldn't be there. The evidence was there. I can't believe in my own eyes. But the truth was there. She really was. She really is. Mm -hmm. Damn it. I fucked it up. I fucked up in my throat. She was really a he. I started to shake. So the cute girl I had fallen for her school. The wonderful girl who was talking about mangas and, and animes with Rika-chan. The girl I was dating for almost two weeks. The girl I was about to kiss today. The girl was a boy, a guy, a dude, a man, what the? Still on the ground, motionless. You, you, you're a, you're a boy? I shot, I couldn't believe it. My loudness made her, I mean him, scared of it. He stepped back a little. Sorry, sorry, Sakura-chan. I didn't mean to scare you. Uh, no, I mean, I mean Sakura-chan. Uh, I'm completely confused. I feel gl giddy. It's incredible, you... But, you know, I... I don't get it. You're a guy, but you dress as a girl. Sakura turned around facing the sun, and he started to, to talk calmly. I was born with a very rare, well, I don't know if it's a genital disorder or something. Technically, I inherit all the chromosomes of my mother, but I got an Y chromosome anyway. It made me a very, sh a very girlish boy. So clear as that, even my, even my brain is one of a girl. I was a normal boy when I was young, but my mind and body transformed me as I grew older. <clears throat> I was more attracted by dolls than little cars. I prefer talking with the girls than playing soccer with the boys. Actually, guys, guys who are straight, even like, um, I'm being true here, guys. Uh, I'm a dude, straight up. Like, I know I'm, I'm not gay. I'm not gay at all. <clears throat> There's nothing wrong with a guy hanging out with girls. You know that he doesn't hang out with the dudes or anything like that. He hangs out with the guys or anything like that. But there's nothing wrong with him hanging out with the girls. Like, hang out, like mainly just hanging out with girls. There's nothing wrong with that. He would just take it the wrong way saying, oh, he's gay and blah, blah, blah. This game is actually showing, I just noticed that this game is actually showing you, don't judge by appearance. Don't even judge by what they are, who they are. Just don't judge by at all, anything at all. Yo, me, I don't judge. Oh, shit. Oh, no, the game. Okay. Okay, let me get back to the game. <laughs> but I'm just being real right there, guys, so, yeah. All right, back to the game. When I was two, two, my dad started to get exhausted of that comedy that changed inside of me. So he started getting me back into a male stuff. He bought me out funds and books usually made for boys. But as time passed and and his alcohol addiction grew, he started to become more violent. He even tried to cut my hair once. Uh, hang on a second. Uh, <clears throat> uh, uh, okay. He even tried to cut my hair once, but my mother protected me. She has always protected me and my choices no matter what. Uh, crap. Hang on a second, guys. Ah, uh, ooh, ah, crap. Uh, ee, oh. Uh, oh, crap. Hang on a second. Uh, be back in a second. Oh, crap. Uh, God dang it. Where is it at? I can't find it. Where, where's it at? Uh, crap, 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 crap. Guys, I think I've lost my favorite toy, which is my shotgun. I can't find it anywhere. Okay, back to the video. I'm back. Uh, <clears throat> I can't help it. I feel like a girl inside, that's all. Actually, my father is really pissed off at me. My mother tries to protect me, but my father becomes crazy when I'm around. Ah, I know I'm taking in her, his monologue, slowly digesting in hers. I don't know what to do. 
Anyway, he wasn't very happy about his life. So you want to be a girl, no matter what everybody thinks. And whatever you, your own body thinks, you want to be a girl and that's all? Yes. Hmm. I think for a moment, but I finally smiled. I finally smiled. And accepted it. He, hey, after all, maybe she's a boy, but Sakura is still a Sakura. Don't you think? Hmm, okay, it's okay for me. Really? Yes, yes, whatever. If you you are happy like this, I'm happy for you as well. Sakura was still facing away from me. <clears throat> ah, God, can't get just in this bed. You have questions, don't you? That wasn't a question. It's scary how he can read my mind in this moment. Go ahead, please. My, you're my friend. It's no one to you have to to have questions about this, and you have the right to know more. I smiled. Okay. So you prefer the one prefer that one one say she to you instead of he. Yes. I see. All right. And well, what about your uh breasts? I see well that your your chest is well. Mm, oh, there's a problem with nothing inside. And why this? Why those? I always dreamed of having real breasts and wearing a bra. I was talking about this. Do you ever think about doing surgery? I thought about it, but I don't want to. I'm too afraid of surgery. How cute! Uh, what the heck am I saying? I'm it's a guy. I can't fall in love with the dude, even if it looks like a girl. Even if he looks like such a wonderful person. Darn, what should I do? I'm lost. Please help me, what should I do? Actually, guys, I don't judge. Who cares if you're gay or not? I'm straight. So, I see guys naked all the time in the locker room, so why should I care? Why should anybody care? Jeez, girls, I got girls in the locker room, what the hell? Guys see guys naked in the locker room, so and guys see so there's nothing wrong with you looking. Well, actually, there's something wrong with you looking, but still, there's nothing wrong with you being like that. I'm straight as hell. I got my girlfriend is a beautiful woman, and I do not give a shit if people start calling me gay or something like that. Even though I'm hating on my girlfriend, who gives a fuck? So let's just pick. Okay, what the fuck? That's going to like. Just, okay, just shut the fuck up, Peter. Yeah. Okay, it's a guy. So what? Who said that love can only work with the opposite gender? I love Sakura since the start. I desired her since the beginning. She told me that she was she's a boy, but I still love and desire her. So be it. I love Sakura Chan no matter what she, he or she is. I understand now why you're why you rejected me when I was tried when I tried to kiss you. Yes. I smiled and started to come close to her. As a grown soul, I prefer boys to girls. But I was afraid to break our hearts if I do this. She felt that I was behind her, so I, she turned around. I didn't want to lose my friend. And I mean, her ears like right under her chin. What the fuck? I didn't leave leave her to finish her sentence. While she was talking, I came closer to her, took her in my arms, kissed her by surprise. She tries to step back in the first second, but finally she relents. Our lives were united to love lovingly. Yes, I love her. I don't care about what people still say. It's a girl, and I love her. That's all. We start kissing. Sakura Shan looked at me in her in the eyes. I was swimming into her two oceans that are her eyes. Tachi kun. Sakura san. We kissed again a more torrid kiss. Plans were running running against her running against her down her bike. So girly is so perfect. Ah Her fingers were in my hair and she was holding me tighter. We stayed for a long time in the rice or peels, silently cuddling each other and kissing sometimes. We couldn't stop. The sun was turning orange and as every evening arrived. He held hands as we returned home. We were silent. We need we no need for for talk. We were just enjoying time together as lovers. 
my heart was being so so much that it was almost painful, but I didn't really care at all. She suddenly holds my arm tighter. I wonder what Rika Chan will say when she finds out about this. <laughs> Maybe she's gonna try to kill you, knowing knowing her. Uh, in, f in fact, I've always wondered if she was in love with me or something. She's like you, you know. She's like you know, since she knows the secret. Really? <laughs> to be honest, she's kind of scares me. She kind of scares me more now. It's like a chunk giggles. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll protect you. She rubbed her head against my shoulder as we were in front of her house. I couldn't resist her touch. I took her in my arms and kissed her again. She kissed me back softly. When she stops, she smiles, squeezes my butt, and whispers in my ear. See you tomorrow, sweetheart. <laughs> you look like a guy when you're going ahead like this. You're mean. She sticks her tongue out before running it to her house and disappears inside. I don't know what happened inside of me. I was flooded with air. I was flooding with energy and happiness. Before going home, I ran along the streets. I ran and ran and ran and ran as fast as I can. I want to sing. I want to laugh. I want to dance. I feel completely crazy. I've never felt like felt that what that kind of kind of euphoria. You, uh, euphoria before. Okay, fine. Fuck it. My God, that was a day. I wonder how things will be tomorrow since she decided that we were going to be having another day tomorrow. Though I don't mind, I was about to ask her out on a date too. It was scary how much lovers can predict minds of their art partners. I was waiting for Sakura, Sakura in the train station of the village. I was getting used to being to these trips now, but I'm tired of today. I couldn't sleep at all last night. So much excitement, thinking about how having a lovely, lovely day with Sakura. Sakura Chan. <clears throat> Tiger then appears joyfully. She was listening to some music on her CD player. When she saw me, she put on a big smile and turned off the CD player and walked to me. Oh, wait, hey, hello. Tachikun, sorry, get away. Good morning, Sakura chan. Okay, hang on a second. Uh, uh, we kiss each other. God, I miss these sweet lips so much. God, this fool sounds like a freaking pedophile, like around the spot. You look wonderful today, Sakura chan. Well, she does, because you said last time she's wearing the same damn dress every single freaking time. That was true. She was, she was looking like oozing of happiness. I've never seen her so happy before. Hmm, doesn't mean that I'm not pretty every other day. Uh, no, I mean, you're pretty as usual. I mean, uh, you're always, oh, son of a bitch. Sakura makes a naughty grin and makes, gives me a quick kiss on the lips. Okay, if this is going to be, like, you can at least make it, idiot be Baka. Ah, screw it. Baka, I'm toying around with you. God, you're mean. We left together as the train arrived in the station. We were sitting in the train. Okay, give me a sec give me a second guys. I got I got a call. Alright guys, I'm at the end of the video here. Uh, I gotta go do some stuff. Um but the next video will probably be later on today in the morning. I I doing both I did one video this morning, but I'm doing do another one later on. But right now I'm going to um uh think of another video pick I'm trying to find I found another game that I'm probably gonna make a video of later on. But still, I'm trying to come, trying to uh, figure out what I'm going to do. Uh, I'll text E, get some ideas from him. We'll text, uh, just say stuff in commentary. Tell me what, tell me what y'all think of the video. Tell me what I could, what else you want me to do. What other um, games like this or anything like that, uh, I can back and look up and try to find and play. But um, uh, I'll talk to y'all guys later. See ya. Video ends here.